Although school is just kind of getting started, many athletes have been practicing, especially football, over the last week and a half or so in this grueling heat that we're dealing with. Our Olivia Leach today taking a real close look at how one Tarrant County School District is using indoor training facilities now to keep their students safe while they practice. North Crowley High School senior Ronnie Claiborne remembers what it was like to practice outdoors in the blazing summer heat. Uh, the pads get heavy and it just get hot, get real hot under a helmet and then with hair on your head. But about three years ago, Crowley ISD built this indoor training facility that makes it a lot easier for Ronnie and his teammates to practice all summer long. It offers a, a shelter from the elements, um, whether it be heat, whether it be cold. Practicing in here is way cooler. It has fans in here, and outside is just the heat. The sun's on you the whole time. Without it? They would have to either cancel practice, or they would have to go inside the building, and inside the building, you don't have the area. You don't have the space. We use these thermometers to test the difference between the temperature inside the building and outside the building. Outside the building, it's about 112 degrees. The temperature inside is just 93 degrees. Coaches like Eli Reinhardt also get trained on how to identify heat related illnesses. Depending on the heat index, um, at a certain point in the day will dictate how many breaks that we need to take during a certain practice. But coaches and students alike say this indoor facility has been a game changer when it comes to practicing all year round. That's because we get to practice longer and uh, the rain doesn't like limit our practice. We can come in here and practice for however long we need to. Most high schools, most uh, ISDs do have indoor facilities and if they don't, they're, they're trying to make plans to build them because they see the benefits. In Crowley, Olivia Leach, CBS News, Texas.